welcome back to this week's video. Um, we are in the Grampians for the next four days. Um, this is our last official trip before we head off for full-time travel. We have four weeks to go and we're just making sure that we've got everything we need. Everything's in the right place and hopefully everything is all sorted before we do the big lap. So spend the weekend with us in the Grampians. Scores of one by six. <laughs> you didn't win. Look what it is. You got a oh, no. <laughs> Let me double check. Yeah, all right. Count it up. <laughs> Hundred and one for you. Hundred and ten. So I bet you run nine. You can check again. Hundred and one. Seven. Five. Five. So we've gotten to our first camp at Plantation Campground going really well. We didn't empty the water off the coffee machine so all of this got flooded. So we're just drying everything, coffee machine. We've um, actually forgotten my camp chair so I don't have a camp chair to sit on all weekend which is fine, so good. And I don't know if you can see that, but the bucket's got a hole in it. So, it's going great. So good. So, so good. Work at the coffee machine. For you. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> Is there a cockatoo on my back or something?
So I don't know if I really filled you in on what we were doing this weekend. So we've gone to the Grampians. We we're going to stay at the plantation campground, but the toilets really stank and there was not much shade and it was really dusty. So. We ended up staying at the NRMA Caravan Park. I think it was like $30 a night. Um, and it's been really nice. And we've even blocked ourselves off and got this view. And there's been lots of emus over there. So it's been really nice. Um, we're having a few troubles with our wheels on the car. The passenger front passenger wheel has been squeaking heat. So we need to try and get that fixed before we set off for the big lap. Um, but yeah. Welcome. We are on the Murray. We've always wanted to come here, but we didn't think we'd get the time, but we've made it. But guess what? We're bogged again in the sand. So we're using the tire deflator for the first time. We don't have our automatic ones with us, but we've got a King's one, which will do. Easy peasy. So this morning we got up at 6 a.m. to go watch the sunrise at the, I don't know how you say it, Barocca lookout. Um, we got up there and we were in the cloud. So we couldn't see any sunrise, which was really disappointing. But we decided to actually come home. Um, because the trip is actually six, nearly six hours from Bright to the Grampians. So we've traveled three hours today to Echuca and then we've traveled another hour east to, I don't know how to say it, but Alup, Alupna, Alupna, I don't know. But it's only like two and a half hours from home. So we really only added like another hour to our trip. Um, but look how amazing it is. We've got this whole place to ourselves. The water is actually warm, it's crazy. But we're gonna spend the rest of the day here and tomorrow here and then we're gonna head home. from yesterday's bogging on the sand. We are about to head home and that is our last official trip before we do the big lap. So we've actually broken down. We think wheel bearings are broken. So that's great. 
like it happened now and not in a couple of weeks in the middle of Australia. Water.